Hi everyone, my name is Anasha and this is Shayla. Shayla is 8 years old and Shayla is uh, non-verbal <laughs> autistic. Um, when we got our diagnosis six and a half years ago, um, basically I felt alone. I was uh, shoved through this door, door shut behind me and I knew absolutely nothing of autism. I didn't know how to navigate the system. I didn't know where to go, who to turn to. I knew absolutely nothing of autism, far less I didn't know anybody who had kids with autism. So I felt super alone uh, with so many questions. What do I do next? Who do I go to? Where do I get the right services? And so on and so forth. With, uh, with my diagnosis that came from a neurologist, all I was handed, I was handed this piece of paper and I was told to call this person and call these people and call this group and so on and they would help guide me but at the end of the day these people are servicing hundreds and hundreds of families so they are not there to give you that one-on-one -on -one that you need, that, that additional therapy that you need for yourself to help navigate through the system. With finding the right providers for Shayla, it's like I felt like I, my only hope was to turn to the internet. Yes, Shayla is saying hello too. My only hope was to turn to the internet. And again, with the internet, um, search, there were so many providers out there. There's so many of them. So basically, I found like I had to go through a lot of people. I went through multiple speech therapists, <laughs> multiple OT therapists, multiple PT therapists. Uh, tried IBI privately at home. Tried IBI with a center. Um, um, eventually my my basically my journey was uh, trial and fire until mm. I got to the right people that um, helped Shayla the way that I felt suitable and comfortable with with Shayla's voice Shayla's voice is such an amazing platform <laughs> because it's a community of people of loved ones who are leaving the same day to day that you are going through the same thing that you're going through who get to leave their reviews based on their personal experiences leave their reviews of the service providers that they've used <clears throat> in the past that they would recommend to other families going through it. So I highly recommend um, anyone in the, in the special needs community to log on to Sheila's voice recommend a service provider leave a review on a service provider what you're doing is benefiting other families like myself and families who are getting their new diagnosis um, who have nowhere to turn we're benefiting them because they have our personal reviews our personal experiences to go based on it's an amazing platform I highly recommend and I, I wish that you would go on today uh, leave a review recommend a service we're also on um, social media we we're on Twitter, we we're on uh, Instagram, uh, we we're on YouTube. So definitely um, check us out, like, share, subscribe. If you want to hear more videos uh, in regards to families like myself uh, going through this uh, day to day, um, definitely like and subscribe to this video, uh, share this video, and uh, hopefully we get to talk to you soon. So this is Shayla. Say bye, Shayla. Say bye, Shayla. Say bye. Thanks guys, take care.